Here, on your water. Whew. October uh, 23rd. October 23rd. And uh, unbelievable weather. This is uh, crazy weather, actually. It's 21.5 in the cabin right now, degrees Celsius. And I uh, brought my little 22 today. And we're going to see if we can uh, maybe get a rabbit or a squirrel or a grouse or something. So we can cook some soup. A bit too warm for soup though today, but we're going to do it anyway. Hopefully we get something to put in there so we don't have to eat vegetable soup. But anyway, we're going to get out and about, go for a little stroll. Uh, I'm going to check the site on this 22 because I haven't used it in a couple of years. And uh, then we're going to get, get to uh, hunting. Heard a squirrel out here. It's a little joke tree somewhere. Let's see if the answer's back. What is it? Good boy! Good boy! Hey! Where'd it go? Come on buddy, let's go this way. Down again. Did you get him buddy? Huh? Where's the rabbit? Where is he? Where's the bunny? You catch him? Hey. Good puppy. Good puppy. Good boy. Go get him, buddy. Go get him. You get him, okay? That's a good puppy. That's a good puppy. You get those rabbits. You get them, buddy. You send them back this way, okay? Where is he, buddy? Luke just flushed out a squirrel. Sounds like Lukey made him mad. Right here somewhere. Let's see if we can get a shot at him. Oh, I see him. Yes! Got him that time, Luke. Got him, Luke? Got him, buddy? Get him! Bring him over. Good job, Lukey. What? What is it? Is it more, man? Oh, yeah. Right in the chest. Wow, what is it? What is it? Squirrel! A squirrel! 
Good job, buddy. You flushed them out. Good job. <laughs> Sorry. Oh, looks like we're going to have some squirrel soup for supper, eh? Huh? Good boy. Let's go get this guy cleaned up. We'll get some supper going, eh? Good job, buddy. Good boy. Good boy. You got him. You got him. Good boy, Lukey. Good job, Lukey. Let's go back to the cabin. Hey? Go back to the cabin? Huh? That was pretty awesome. Lukey was on a couple of rabbits there and then he uh, he flushed out that little red squirrel. So I got a shot. Actually, I missed the first shot, but got a second shot and uh, killed him instantly when with the second shot there. But it is warm walking through the woods. Anyway, I got some stuff there for soup, so I was hoping I would get something. A squirrel, a rabbit, grouse, something. But uh, I'll get the squirrel cleaned up, a little red squirrel. For those of you who don't know, uh, red squirrel is on the small game license this year. Uh, before it was just trappers who could uh, who could uh, trap squirrel, but now they're on the small game. So yeah, lots and lots of red squirrels around. So I mean, not many people are actually going to hunt them, but I'll hunt them because I'll eat them and I'll keep the pelt too as long as the pelt's not too uh, damaged because I have my trappers license too. So anyway, I'll get them uh, cleaned up here and we'll get some. We'll get some food going. All right, guys. So not much to them. I had to. Uh, one arm was pretty much all bones, so all uh, broken up bones where I shot them into the chest here. But not much to them. Obviously, little red squirrel, little male. There we go. We'll get some a uh, little bit of flavor in the pot anyway. Some oil. Get some oil in there. Lots of onion. Really full onion. Hey buddy. Don't worry, you're gonna get your supper soon. Onion! I got some salt meat. Bite sized pieces. Cajun. So we'll give that a little saute, then we'll add some water, and uh, we'll let her simmer for a bit, and then we'll add some vegetables. get that to a boil and then we'll uh, turn it down and let it simmer for a while then we'll throw in some veggies we got some turn up carrot little potatoes but I'm gonna dice those up a little bit and I always like like to have some kind of filler either uh, rice or uh, usually macaroni but this is all I had on hand, so. Penne, penne or something, whatever. I don't know how to pronounce it, but. Carrots, carrots. Well, there's gonna be a lot of soup, one person. Lukey already had a supper. 
Colonel. And I'll wait a few minutes before I put the potatoes in because they never take as long to cook. Gonna be good. Okay, the potatoes are in. One last ingredient. A little bit of pasta. Get down out of there. You're going to burn your nose. Get down. As soon as that pasta is cooked a little bit, we'll get her, uh, we'll get a bowl of soup and some bread. Squirrel soup, Luke. Squirrel soup, Luke. All thanks to you, buddy. Hey, okay. All thanks to you. call that done anyway. Can't wait any longer. I got my uh, mixing bowl here for my soup bowl. I find that uh, the normal bowls that you have in your cupboard, your glass bowls, which usually comes with a dish set, is not big enough for soup or cereal. So I'll, I always use a, a bigger bowl, a mixing bowl or something. Well, I usually use it for soup and cereal. so I'm probably going to burn my mouth off here. Let's see if there's any more squirrel in there. Oh, here we go. Lukey doesn't like to settle down for very long. Eh? He likes to be... Luke likes to be on the move. Alright, we'll try it out, Lukey buddy. Actually, not you, Luke. You already ate. Bread, got beverage, it's a warm beverage now because it's been hot in this cabin all day and this has just been sitting in my backpack. So. I see you over there, buddy. Squirrel backstrap. Mmm. Oh, it's good though. Nice and salty. Mm -mm -mm. What are you looking for, mister? Mm -hmm. You can go out if you want, buddy. Let's see what we get there. Rib cage. It's just still too hot to eat. So this is uh, I think this is a front corner. <laughs> Not much to it. Not much to it at all. 
I find squirrels pretty similar to rabbit actually. They're pretty much eating the same things. Mostly the same things. Yeah, you definitely want a few for a good meal. So guys, lots of stuff coming up. You know, I've been working lots since the first day I had, had off. I was off yesterday, but uh, my daughter was playing softball, so I went and spent the day watching that, obviously. But, uh, yeah, so I got today off, but I got to get up at 5 tomorrow and drive back to work. One more week, I think, at the project where I am now. And then, uh, I think the 31st, I have to start at the new project, which is in Beta Verde. Beta Verde, Newfoundland. And I, I should be there until Christmas, I think. But we'll be doing a 10, 10 days on and 4 days off work schedule, so... Those four days off, I'll definitely try to get some uh, something out. But yeah, big plans like besides the cabin build, the new cabin I'm building. Besides that, I want to build an ice shack this year. So uh, ice fishing season opens February February first. So I want to have a ice shack all ready to go for uh, February first. I'm hoping Santa is going to bring me a fish finder. If I'm a good boy, maybe. And uh, what else? Um, oh, uh, I'm wearing these Hardland pants. I don't know if you guys noticed. These Hardland uh, tactical pants. They sent me. They sent me a pair here to uh, test out and do a review, uh, and I'm loving them so far. So I uh, look forward to a review of, of these pants and uh, I'll talk a little more about them. And uh, also Blue Eddie sent me a power station. I don't know if you guys seen Kyle Noseworthy's video there on that uh, Blue Eddie power station he has. Uh, they sent him one too to do a review so I'm really looking forward to using that once I start staying here more and working at the other cabin. And I'll be able to use it in the new ice shack. When I get a new ice shack built, I'll be able to uh, charge fish finder, like charge all my camera gear, everything with it. Eh? I'll be able to light the light the ice shack, everything. Because I, I want to build an ice shack that I can actually stay in overnight. So the Blue Eddy power station is definitely going to come in, come in uh, handy. So look for a review of that one as well. And shout out to Blue Eddy, shout out to Hardland for sending me the stuff to uh, test out. Also guys, I'm closing in on 20,000 subs. Thanks a lot to everybody who's subscribed. You know, I, I have friends, lots of friends on YouTube now that, that uh, have been subscribed to me for a long, long time. Ever since the uh, early, early trapping days here on YouTube for me. Stuff like that. So, uh, big thanks to all you guys. So what I'm going to do, I'm going to have a... Uh, giveaway some kind of um, it's not going to be a contest or anything it's just going to be a giveaway when I hit 20,000 I'll I'll uh, put it in a video somewhere I'll probably send some some people some hoodies ferro rods uh, I have a few more things in uh, in mind so uh, yeah make sure you uh, hit the bell notification so you don't miss any videos and you won't miss the uh, the giveaway it'll be a, a just a like no contest will be no no sharing this or sharing that or uh, tagging people or nothing like that I just wanted to have a giveaway for my subscribers everyone who's uh, subbed so far so 20,000 is a pretty big milestone for me but yeah um, 20,000 was a was a goal of mine for this year I wanted to hit 20,000 and uh, you know I've been working lots this year so I haven't got as many videos out as I would have liked but definitely gonna make that up to everybody over the winter here when I uh, finish up work for the season so like I said log cabin priority ice shack some review videos obviously lots of camping here in this cabin so yeah be lots of videos man I am pumped oh also I was telling you guys about my GoPro quit on me I just so happened to have a subscription to the GoPro so um they, they are replacing my GoPro 9 for free, absolutely free. They sent me a shipping label, 
through email. I sent back my old one and my my brand new GoPro Hero 9 should be shipped out this week coming. So that was pretty awesome of them to uh, ship me a brand new one for free. Do some more hunting with Lukey too. Um, luckily Lukey was with me today because he flushed out this squirrel. I had no idea it was there but I guess Lukey sniffed them out there and uh, the squirrel kind of got mad and was chirping at him and stuff. So. Now I have squirrel soup, thanks to Luke. <laughs> but yeah, I wasn't gonna, I, like, when I got Lukey, I just wanted him as like a house dog and, and a woods dog with me, like a companion, but, and I wasn't gonna train him for hunting, but it's just, it's too much in his instincts to run off and chase whatever, so I might as well, you know, I just put a bell on him. I got bear bell, a bear bell on him from when we're in the woods, and, uh, I might as well just carry a gun. I've got small game license and everything, so I might as well just carry a gun. And if he flushes something out to me, that's pretty awesome. He's a good dog, though. Okay. <laughs> Third and final bowl. But the bottom of the pot is always the best. Unfortunately, I got all the squirrel eat. But I can get off the bone. Ready to go, buddy? I think that is in the treats. Treats? It's not treats, buddy. I'll get you a treat when we get home, okay? Because you are such a good boy today. Excuse me. Ready to go, pup? Yeah, we'll get going. Okay, guys. Thanks a lot for coming along. Hope you enjoyed the video. Like I said, don't forget to hit the bell notification so you know when uh, I upload. That way you won't miss the uh, the giveaway video once I hit 20,000 subs here. Hopefully before New Year's. That'd be awesome. But anyway, greatly appreciate everybody who watches. And uh, we'll catch you on the next video. Take care.